East African community partner member states, namely Uganda, Kenya, Rwanda, and South Sudan, have reaffirmed their commitment to collaborate closely in order to realize the long-awaited standard gauge railway line connecting the East African region. This decision was announced during the SGR cluster meeting held in Kampala. The gathering brought together officials from the participating countries and aimed to revitalize the implementation of the project, which had faced delays in the recent years. It was agreed that Uganda would take the lead in sourcing financing and expediting the construction of the Kampala Bihanga Mirama Hill section of the SGR with the goal of completing it by 2029. This segment is considered crucial for linking the capital city of Uganda with the broader SGR network. At least we are aware SGR now has been constructed from the port of Mombasa up to Naivasha in Kenya. Preparations are in high gear for the construction from Naivasha, Kisumu up to Maraba. Preparations are high in high gear for the construction from Maraba up to Kampara. And of course, thereafter, we are also constructing from Kampara, Kasese. The idea of establishing a standard gauge railway linking the East African region to the port of Mombasa in Kenya was initially proposed in 2014 by governments of Kenya, Uganda, and Rwanda. However, challenges such as the COVID-19 pandemic and funding delays have hampered progress on this multi-billion dollar project. So the global chain, uh, supply chain was affected and uh, we are not receiving the, the volumes of freight that uh, we should have been, been receiving. And then also the economic activities uh, went down. So the evaluation will be done when the economy has uh, stabilized uh, so that we are able to see the real impact of uh, SGR. The period we have gone through was not the best to do that uh, evaluation. Uganda, in particular, had decided in 2017 to prioritize the construction of the Gulu Nimule railway line, which would connect with South Sudan before proceeding with the western route of Kampala to Kasese to Mirama. It was only in September 2022 that Uganda began updating its two-year feasibility study for the Kampala to Kasese to Mpondwe to Mirama route, indicating a renewed focus on advancing the SGR project. Uh, for us in South Sudan, we had also a task. Uh, one was, as a country, we were supposed to have started the process of studies, feasibility studies, to understand uh, how this project is going to benefit us and other related important factors that should have been considered also. So uh, that has not happened, but the plans are there. The implementation of the SGR in the East African region has faced challenges and delays in the recent years. However, the renewed commitment of the ESC partner member states will significantly enhance regional connectivity and trade, boosting economic growth and facilitating movement of goods and passengers within the region. Wadulo Makanold, UBC News.